Hey guys, it's me and Tyrese coming to you with another seafood mukbang. Um, we got a, a lot of extra stuff, more than we had the last time. And let me see if I hold this one. See if I can pick it up so you guys can see what I have. Okay, we got mussels in here. Let me get closer. We got mussels, snow crab, king crab, corn, potatoes, shrimp, and some cut up lemon in here. Um, we didn't do the sausage because I, I don't know, I'm trying to kind of get away from certain meats. So, yeah. So, hopefully, this is good. I have not tried it. Um, you want to go get some pork? We can eat a lot. We don't need it. Okay. Okay. We got a little butter sauce on the side. Show you guys that. For, for it to be my first time, um, not my first time cooking the mussels, but trying to do it all together in one day, it's, it's, it tastes pretty good. How you like it so far? Good. Potato. We got the little finger potatoes this time. Don't eat up all the muscles now. Let's try some milk. <laughs> It's spicy too. You like it spicy? Yep. Me too. We got two. Oh, go them. I forgot. This is good. Now, if you don't like spicy seafood, this might not be the dinner for you because it's really spicy. But I like spicy food anyway, so. I finally got me some king crab. Come on, get you one. I'm gonna try to make a, a thumbnail. Come on, put that in. Oh, my favorite part. Okay, let me see. I'm gonna turn it around. And... Okay. She got it wrong. Okay. I'm I'm trying to do it like. Turn around, turn around. Yeah, turn around. Okay. Close. He turned around the wrong way.
I hope it's good, y'all. We got it from where we go? Publix. We went to Publix to get it, and it was really like frozen. Did I lose my towel? Um, still recording on the tablet. <laughs> I'm mean, on the um on the laptop. It's kind of hard to see what angle thing is coming from, but I keep dropping my towel. I need my towel. Oh, that's a lot of meat. I know you eat fast, but don't try to eat it off of me, okay? <laughs> I actually like these, um, I guess you would call them finger potatoes. I like those better than I like the red potatoes. I mean, I love the red potatoes. I like both. I like potatoes. <coughs> <laughs> I mean the cough in your face, I'm sorry. <coughs> and we're drinking cran lemonade. And I know I said I wasn't going to be doing these all the time, but right now I just got a taste for seafood. So we've been eating a lot of chicken <laughs> and, you know, trying to stay away from the red meats and stuff. <clears throat> you don't have much of a choice to choose from. Oh, sorry. Yeah, I don't worry. When we get our camera, our videos are going to be much better. <laughs> much, much better. But you guys see this out of meat. Oh, that's a lot of meat. Look. Oh, God. So, you know, I'm here for that. <laughs> yes, sir. I'm here for that. I don't want fat, though. You going? Get the other one? How you gonna get all of it from me? Yeah. Um. This is not that bad. Oh, you gonna give me the small hair? 
Where you got that? Look at all that meat. Mm. And I ain't gonna front. We ain't we ain't used to this. <laughs> um doing the, the bowls and stuff. But I do. Huh. Yeah. Drop that too. Let it fell off. Mm -mm. Gotta put a, a towel across there or something. Cause they don't even see it because your hand in the way. Let me hold up. All that meat he got. Get the fat off. Don't eat all that. Oh. Yeah, it's so spicy. And I know with the way we eat, we're going to have some left for tomorrow. I don't think we're going to be able to, to eat all this, but... We're gonna try try to enjoy what we can tonight. <laughs> Was that enough butter sauce? Alright. I need to do more next time. Hmm. Do you run out, just dump it in the bottom of the pan. So how was you guys Easter? Hopefully you had a wonderful service at church and a wonderful week. It's so small they can't see that. <laughs> yeah, mostly. Yes, go ahead. Oh, you want to try it together? Mm -hmm. They spicy too. Mm -hmm. Favorite part. Yeah, and we not print like we got a lot of money like that. Um, we just love seafood, and we're trying to eat, have better um, diet, and we're leaning more toward um, instead of just going straight up vegan, we're trying to just do vegetarian and just eating. We're eating chicken and fish and vegetables. But do vegetarians eat chicken? <laughs> do they eat chicken? They they just eat fish, right? Oh. Well, I guess I don't know what you call it then. <laughs> if it's not vegetarian, I don't know what you call it because we still eat our chicken, <laughs> just not as much. Cause he he told me. He got tired of chicken, so. That's another reason why we're doing a lot of a lot of fish and stuff. So what we had last week? We had neck bones, then. <laughs> they were good. They were slamming. 
And guys, I hope I'm speaking loud enough where you can hear so that you can hear me. Um, Because I don't want to be just wasting the video. <laughs> and then you guys don't hear nothing I say. And another thing, what I do, I watch... Um, MK's channel, um, Martika Sutton's channel. I got to get around to watching more of her mom's channel. And y'all know I watch um, B Loves Life. I watch her channel. And um, there is another girl I started watching. It's a, it's a few more that I watch, that I like to watch. Um, one of them is in, um, I think she lives in Jacksonville, and she does her mukbangs with her, I think her friends and family members, her husband or something. And another one, I think she's like up north somewhere, I don't know. I watch quite a few of them. If I sit there long enough, you know I'm going to want, okay, you know I'm going to want some seafood. Okay. So let's talk about, okay. Have you seen, um, Acrimony or what's the movie? Black what is it? Wakanda. I was going to say Black Panther, but Wakanda. I haven't seen it yet, but I have to go and see it. I just didn't want to go um, while, you know, the movie is, movie theater is packed, because I don't I don't like being crowded, and I just don't like it. I start having anxiety and stuff, and I just don't like it. I try to go when it's not that many people there, like at the matinee or something. I don't have to worry about nobody stepping on my toes and stepping on somebody else's toes. But Can they say suck the head? I don't know how to. Okay, yeah. We tried crawfish years ago, and we didn't know how to eat it. So I told him we was going to try it again. And then I've been hearing a lot of people say suck the head. I don't know nothing about sucking no head. <laughs> so I'm going to just do the best I can. I'm just going to try to get the meat out the best I can like we did before when we tried it. I think we throw a lot of meat away then <laughs> because we didn't know how to really get the meat out of it. But it was really good. We was like, it's not enough meat. But we really loved it. How is it? I really don't know where it goes. <laughs> they want to see so they get the flavor out. It's not right there, right? Like a shrimp. It's like a shrimp. Man. Make sure you clean it, dude. Like, I don't know. I don't know. Look, 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 I, I have watched, but I feel I got to be present. I got to be omnipresent in it because I just don't know. I'm. <laughs> like a shrimp. Man. I think you peel it back, like, you peel it back. So when they say suck the head, I don't know about that. I ain't finna suck no head. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm not finna do it. <laughs> I'm not finna do it. Yeah. This is the little crawfish. 
they been sucking head. No, I ain't mm -mm, No, I'm not finna suck no head. No. I'm just trying to get the meat out. I think what you do is like peel the head back and get the meat out like that. Oh yeah, you stopping everything over here. <laughs> Ooh. Watch it, son. You good when it come out like that. It's so spicy, y'all. I got it so spicy. It's more spicy than the one, the one I did before. Way spicy. Besides it being real, really spicy, do you like it? Yeah. Just a little bit spicy the next time. Oh, I like it like this. Okay, great. And please, spicy food and bread. Well, yeah, I hope it helped me burn some fat, because y'all see me when I stand up. Y'all know I'm, I'm a big thickums. I didn't get fat to like three years after giving birth to him. Then I lost weight back down. And then I got diagnosed with breast cancer again. And then um, they say it's steroids in that medicine they give you. And I blew up again and it seemed like I got bigger and bigger. And I'm going to tell you another reason why I got bigger and bigger. Vitamins. And when I started drinking my boost drinks that I was showing y'all with my... Um, my CVS all. I was very, I, I wasn't eating that much. And I was just gaining weight and gaining weight. And I was like, it got to be the boost drinks. Because I, I don't cook that much, you know. And when I was cooking, I'd eat maybe once or twice a day. But I was still gaining weight. So I stopped drinking my own. Um, my boost drinks, what I'm going to do is just see where I can donate those drinks. So like a, a um, an elderly facility um, somewhere because this shit can't do it. I can't keep gaining weight. I'm just, mm -mm, I ain't with it. Like, a guy used to talk to me, told me one time, he was like, hey, girl, last time I see you, you were smiling. He said, look like you gave a whole nother person. <laughs> I had never heard nobody speak of it that way. But he was right. My bones ain't built for all this fat. My bones catching heck. They're catching it, trying to carry all this. Huh? You trying to kill him, right? I didn't, it's another box in there. I know. That lemon was strong with that one. So we picked up his pants. Um, he got them tapered. I think the last um, mukbang we did, well, the first, very first mukbang we did, 
we were we had been shopping for his prom clothes or film mm-hmm. so, and um he had to get his pants taped so we picked them up today so I can't wait to see him get dressed for the prom for the prom so this is his junior year um It would be nice if some of his other family members could, could actually see him leaving for the for the prom. But we'll just be taking pictures. Hmm. Oh, I thought you wanted me to hold it up. <laughs> Got a message. So hopefully, since this food is so spicy, hopefully, Cam from Cam's Corner will be losing weight, (laughs) eating spicy foods. The only thing about that is eating spicy foods. Child, a woman of my age, you'll have some hot flashes (laughs) if you're at that stage in your life. Mind it, come on. Normally, it was like medically induced. <laughs> so, I wish I could have avoided it. When I was pregnant with you, I ate a lot of shrimp, a lot of popcorn and shrimp. I ate popcorn and shrimp because I used to be sick all the time. And that was sometimes the only thing that I could keep down, like bottle, like water. I couldn't even drink water from the faucet. I had to buy bottled water to drink because I, the water would make me so sick. I lost a lot of weight too. Drink a lot of water? Mm-mm. I just being pregnant with you. <laughs> being pregnant with you makes me Yeah, I used to be sick a lot. I used to be sick with you and your brother. I used to get mad when I go around people and they have on certain colognes. Then a white diamond. Ugh. It was so disgusting to me. I wanted to. I tried to get um the wanna Rizzo wife. I tried to get her to take me fishing. She she wouldn't take me nowhere. <laughs> I tried. I don't know why I had the craving to go fishing when I was pregnant with you, but I wanted to go fishing so bad. And then when I had you, when I had you, I wasn't even thinking about no fishing. <laughs> but I really wanted to go. It was like a craving that I had. It's like I really wanted to go. But then people started telling me, girl, them snakes gonna rain. 
I mean, how does snakes even got a mind to know somebody crazy? I don't know how that works, but I didn't want to find out, so I'm glad they didn't take me. Which I'm quite sure it's some pregnant people that take their ch- chance, but I'm glad I didn't. <clears throat> Excuse me. So yeah, we're doing pretty good now. We're knocking it out. To be honest, the reason I haven't, I hadn't done one like this size because I didn't think I could do it or it'll taste good or, you know, but I was like, not that this is the biggest one that I've seen. It's not going to be because I don't have that type of money. But it's big for me, for, for it to be me and him. Because then, you know, without it being so much food, we don't have to throw anything away. Phone call me. I mean, message me. I'm calling me at school. I want my phone. It was, it was somebody else's phone. <laughs> he know you at school. He wouldn't call you at school. Eh? Mm. Aaron, no, I feel like that. I'm either I do it or not. I feel more fucking good. Aaron, no, I feel like that. But I still, he know the time that you be in school. Huh? <laughs> Something popped in my face. It would be nice if we had like a little, had it sitting like on a hot plate so it won't get cold so quick. It's still not as cold as the one on the food truck. <laughs> That was froze. <laughs> and it was good when we first got it, but I was like, maybe, you know, maybe it's like just because I placed my order. At, I might have placed my order at the last minute. Yeah. But then no, the time after that, every time I pick, picked up my plate, my food was cold. And I was like, What's what's this about? And I don't know, you know, whether other people's plates were cold or it's about the deep freezer. Huh? That's it's what they were doing. The deep that was, that's what they were doing. Yeah. Um, yeah. Yeah, see, I ain't about that. I like my own warm. And I guess it's just a thing that you gotta have a seafood truck, maybe it's always gonna be cold. I don't know. But I know the one in Brunswick. Yeah, that's what they do. Shook seafood, it was off the chain. We loved it. I only ate more down there, but I was in my family. <laughs> yeah, because the girls they didn't like the smell of the seafood. We went back and then I went at home. Or the girls didn't like it either, so it kind of made me. Kind of make me feel like I don't want to yeah. make them uncomfortable in their own home eating this stuff. So, really, really good. Sure they gone <laughs> I think I ain't. 
I ain't got it popping in my house, you know. We <laughs> got them going on. Here. When they come here, they stay a few minutes. They, <laughs> they be ready to go. <laughs> All that meat. <laughs> yep, a lot of meat. Remind me to get it before we when we start cleaning up. Yep, y'all. A big old chunk of crap on the floor. So my son said that um, he'd be more concerned about my health than I do because of certain junk foods that I eat. But mind you, I don't eat a lot of chocolate like I used to. Because I used to have to have my chocolate. And every now and then, I still do. I had got weaned off of it. But then I started dipping back into it <laughs> every now and again. It's just, I don't know. It's hard to just quit. It just keep calling me and calling me. Huh? We have this for tomorrow then. Yeah, so I have came to the conclusion, y'all. So far. King crab and snow crab is my favorite. Or the queen crab, my favorite. <laughs> and Publix also had some Dungeness crab, but it was a little bit, a little bit more expensive. And I was like, we might try that next time if they have it. Green pepper not yet. I'm about to. I think on the only fresh that potato and corn are my favorite part. I like the meat with potatoes and corn are my favorite part. Mm -mm. <laughs> Is your favorite part of seafood what man? No, my favorite part, like, the flavoring. The flavoring. Mm hmm. I love my crab, honey. I love my crab. What did you eat at school today? So, yeah. We're about to tap out. We're not going to let this video um, be as long as the first one that we did. So we are about to put this up. We might eat some more later on tonight, but right now we are done. Peace. Remember, God loves you. God loves you. I do too, and there's nothing you can do about it. Be blessed, everyone. And say bye to my son, Tyrese.
you know I named him after the singer. <laughs>